are on our way to see Puss in Boots. Family of five, wish us luck. the movie? Yeah. yeah. Puss in Boots. Hey, don't step on the gummies. I'm taking the secret exit. Chile Mele. Grayson, did you like the movie? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. children for an hour and a half thumbs up there were a few moments for the really young ones that it was kind of scary but overall I like to put some boots for the rest of this vlog it's gonna be a little bit different I want to try a nari or tofu jerky I have four different kinds that I'm gonna try this one's called a tofu snack and this one is dry bean curd spicy flavor mm, that's what a nari is it's bean curd that's been like marinated in deliciousness. And this is the only one that I got at an, like a more Americanized grocery store called Gotcha. Gotcha, it's a plant-based jalapeno. I'm gonna start with this one because it scares me the most. This one looks the least like jerky. It looks just like tofu bits. It has dry bean curd, spicy hot flavor. Up here it says Joy Tofu. So I guess Joy Tofu is the brand. Should have probably brought water just in case this isn't a good idea. But that's a big piece. It's kind of greasy looking. Uh, you can see like the peppers on it, so it's spicy. There we go. Not what I expected. It tastes like slivers of tofu that have like the chili flakes that you get out of the jar. It's okay. I probably wouldn't order it again. I think it's an acquired taste. For me, I'd probably give it a 5.5 out of 10. Yeah, 5.5 out of 10. Next one, dried bean curd spicy flavor. Commodity, I guess that's the name of the brand. Let's try it. Definitely more like a jerky look to it but it's still it's almost translucent. It looks kind of just like that tofu that we just tried. For me, this one has more of the jerky texture, but less flavor. I feel like it's very subtle. I wouldn't even call it spicy. I'd still kind of say it's on par, but a little bit better than that one. I'm gonna go 6.5 out of 10. You're like, why don't you just eat jerky? Well, I've been a vegetarian since 2020. All right, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna save the one that looks the most like jerky and try the Americanized kind of one, the jalapeno plant-based jerky by Gotcha. It smells like I just put my nose in a jalapeno. It smells super spicy. It looks like a moist piece of jerky. 
Like if you get moist jerky, sometimes jerky is dry, sometimes it's moist. Does that bother you that I'm saying moist? Texturally, this is the most like jerky. Like real jerky. But if you've ever had turkey jerky, it's kind of like turkey jerky. That's what this kind of reminds me of, turkey jerky. Not beef jerky. Again, no spice. Have my taste buds gone? Like, can I not taste spice? I mean, I'm tasting the flavor. I'm just not, I'm not tasting spice. This one's got a much more unique flavor. It's almost like, it's almost like a smoked jalapeno, which I appreciate. I actually like this one. I'm gonna go ahead and give this one a 7.5. 7.5 out of 10. Gotcha jerky. This whole bag is 120 calories and 24 grams of protein. So that's a lot of protein because there's two servings in this bag. I love that. Please be higher than a 7.5. Please be higher than a 7.5. Come on. This one has a lot more calories. You can see it is moist inside the bag. Tofu snack is the name. 34 grams of protein in this bag, 348 calories per serving. That's a truckload of calories. That's like a meal for me nowadays. Product of Taiwan. It looks like beef. It looks like the, the stands that you go by on your way to Vegas and it's like the beef jerky stands. That's what it looks like. Does it taste like it? Moment of truth. Cheers. Ooh. Mmm. Oh my goodness. Wow. This one's sweet. This one tastes so similar to Inari, like Inari sushi. If you like Inari sushi, you're gonna love this beef jerky. It's not exact, but it's so close. Is it my favorite jerky in the entire world? No. Is it really good? Yes. I'm gonna give it an 8.8 .8 out of 10. Maybe even a nine. It reminds me so much. It's just, the only reason I don't want to give it a nine is because it has so many calories. It's super moist. Like, even when I'm eating it, it's not dry at all. It's sweet. Oh my goodness, it tastes so much like a Nari Sushi. I'm gonna bump it to nine. My name reveal for uh, Mystery Dog tomorrow. <laughs> I picked a name. I like it. Those of you that are enjoying the daily content, I'm extremely honored and I'm grateful and there's a lot that's gonna happen this year. <laughs> a whole lot. So I hear you don't like the light bright. Oh, this? Yeah. I like it, it brought back a lot of memories. And my sister got it for our kids, which is very thoughtful. But uh, our kids and all these <laughs> 200 plus glowing pegs. <laughs> nah, they don't do well with that because <laughs> I'm stepping on them, they're everywhere, they're shooting up my foot. to throw the light bright in the river. <gasps> so peace out, light bright. <laughs> we'll keep it for later when they can sit at a table and use it. So are you gonna gather all these pegs? Pegs is what they call them here. I call them mother beepers that I keep stepping on. You gonna are you gonna pick up the 200 plus glowing <laughs> eggs that are everywhere now so they can sit with this 
play with it properly. 